Hello Capricorn, thank you so much for checking out this video. This is going to be a you versus them love reading for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. It'll be a general love reading, so it will not resonate with everyone watching. Take what resonates, leave the rest, and check out your other placements for more messages. Sometimes those can resonate more. All right, Capricorn, let's get into it. Spirit, what messages do you have for Capricorn, please? in regards to love and the person they're connecting with this will be for those of you who already have a connection in mind all right let's see for capricorn spirit what messages do you have for capricorn so i'm going to look at your energies your person's energies and the mutual energies between you we'll start with the mutual energies first Mutual energies, please, spirit for Capricorn and the person they are. Whoop. Okay. One fell on the ground here. Two of Cups reversed. Nine of Wands reversed. Ten of Pentacles reversed. I don't like these energies, Capricorn. There's a loss of security here, stability. There's a, sh a, a relationship on shaky ground. Could, could have been a full-on breakup here between you and another person, you and this person. Um, you could be uh, married to this person. You could have children with this person. Doesn't have to be, but this is a card for family with the Ten of Pentacles. Reverse it means financial hardships, struggles, financial struggles. Um, now with the Nine of Wands reverse, this could be that you are overcoming feelings of exhaustion or overcoming feeling so guarded about something. Um, it could also mean that you are being kind of stubborn and refusing to budge, refusing to leave a situation or improve a situation because you're kind of stuck where you are. All right, let's see. Let's look at your energies. I'm gonna have you on this side and your person on the other side. Feel free to flip the roles. Spirit, what can you tell me about Capricorn's thoughts or feelings towards this connection Capricorn's thoughts or feelings please death reversed okay sign of Scorpio with death this is resisting change resisting transformation resisting an ending tell me more about Capricorn's energies please nine of Pentacles freedom stability security confidence Six of Pentacles reversed. I feel like you stopped giving to this connection or there was an imbalance here between you and this person. One person was giving more than the other. And with Nine of Cups reversed, it could be that what, what, what you thought was a wish fulfillment ended up not being the case. It wasn't what you thought it was going to be. Okay. So let's see about your person. Tell me about Capricorn's person, please. Huge thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, subscribed, or commented. I really appreciate it. Capricorn's person. Two of Wands reversed. What else can you tell me about their person? That is way too many. What else can you tell me? Page of Swords. Interesting. The tower the tower did want to come out earlier so we got two of wands reversed here page of swords so this person could be doing research watching you wanting to communicate with you and then we got the tower these are some very interesting energies here I feel like one person on this side, this person here, could be you Capricorn, because this is this is who I'm seeing as your energy, but again, feel free to flip the roles if they resonate more with your situation, because energy can be flipped. Um, I feel like this person's resisting this ending or this, this situation that's happening here. Um, but at the same time, they don't want to give. It's almost like they want to be free, 
They want to be secure. They want to do their own thing, but they don't want things to change. It's very weird. I'm going to clarify all of these. This person over here with the two of wands reversed, um, something that had potential no longer has potential. Um, they could have also been debating on which path to take and made a choice. I am going to clarify all of these to get some more insight. Um, there was a huge shake up here with the tower, something unexpected on, in this person's life or in this situation, this person caused a tower moment possibly. Um, and then we got the page of swords. So it's almost like this person is now thinking of a different approach or wanting to talk. Um, again, doing research, watching, observing. So we'll see. We'll see what all of these are about here. I was going to clarify with a different deck, but I'm getting, I'm being told no. So let's clarify with the same deck here. Or Capricorn, please. Messages for Capricorn. Let's start with this Two of Cups reverse. Can you tell me about this Two of Cups reverse for Capricorn, please? Three of Wands reversed. Someone, um, there's been a delay or a complete shift in plans. Um, something uh, someone was waiting for something and never came someone was waiting for something to return to them or come back or or something to improve it it didn't someone got tired of waiting here possibly for a connection to improve it's almost like someone got tired of waiting for a connection to improve tell me about this nine of wands reverse there's this nine of wands reversed here for Capricorn spirit. Page of wands reversed. I feel like someone gave up with this nine of wands reversed. Someone gave up, gave up because this page of wands reversed here. This is someone who can't finish what they start. It's not somebody you can really count on. They're kind of all over the place. Um, they take unnecessary risks. I feel like this energy, it's, it's, it's like an energy that someone just gave up on. Could also be an, a message that never came or a beginning that never came. Um, a huge delay in the beginning of something new. Tell me about this Ten of Pentacles reversed for Capricorn. Tell me about this Ten of Pentacles reversed, please. Yeah, look at this. Ace of Swords reverse, possibly because of lies, bad communication, lack of communication. Um, this could also be extremely harsh words being exchanged. Um, lack of clarity. Someone that's not honest with themselves also could be. So let's look at your side. Why death reverse? My death reverse the high priestess so your intuition is telling you something it's causing a delay and a and in a transformation here or um, you're waiting for something it's like there's something that you still don't know or or something that hasn't been expressed that's keeping you from ending a situation or changing something in your life. Tell me about this Nine of Pentacles for Capricorn. Tell me about this Nine of Pentacles, please. Six of Cups reversed. Someone's stuck in the past here, thinking about the past, happy memories, um, my gosh, my card's going crazy. Tell me more about this Nine of Pentacles, please. This is, again, someone that's doing it things on their own. They don't need anybody else. They're independent, free, unattached. 
Give me something about this Nine of Pentacles reverse. Give me more, please, Spirit. Five of Cups reversed. Someone here, this Nine of Pentacles energy wants to return to the past. Wants to recover something that was lost in their past. Tell me about the Six of Pentacles reversed. They possibly became single because they are wait wanting to recover what they lost. Tell me about the Six of Pentacles in reverse. For Capricorn, please. Queen of Swords reversed. Wow. So this person's completely checked out emotionally drawing serious boundaries here no longer wanting to give to this connection no longer wanting to put in effort this queen of swords is not a, a happy person they are they're very harsh sometimes cruel um it's almost like it, it was one too many times that they got screwed over yep. tell me about this nine of cups reverse Tell me about this sign of cups reverse. The chariot, sign of cancer. So someone here is moving forward. Something didn't work out, so they're moving forward. They thought this was going to be their wish fulfillment. They thought they were going to be emotionally fulfilled, and they weren't. Or it turned out to be something else entirely, and they're moving on. Choosing a different direction here. But with the Six of Swords reverse at the bottom of the deck here, it's almost like there's a delay in being able to move on or a delay in, in going on this new in, in this new direction. This could also be someone that wants to come back, that doesn't want to leave. So it's like a very um contra it's like a contradictory or contra there's a contradiction here. I can't even speak. Um, this person is almost like they 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 want to move forward. They want to transform. They want a new direction, but something's keeping them from making that change completely. I think it has to do with the past, not being able to let go of something in the past, wanting to return to the past. And that can mean a few things. For example, this could be someone who really was in love really this was possibly a family unit and they they think there's still hope here for change so they are hesitant to end something for example so let's look over here at this person tell me about this two of wands reverse thank you we got the moon sign of pisces and knight of cups wow Someone has a lot of feelings here, a lot of emotions here. Um, they want to express how they feel towards someone. This is a Romeo. However, with the moon, I'm getting that this is unexpected or a secret. Um, they're keeping this to themselves. Tell me about this page of swords. Tell me about this page of swords, please, for Capricorn's person. Eight of Cups reversed. This person wants to return too, or doesn't want to leave, but this is the card of return. Tell me about the page of swords. This could be, I mean, I'm seeing a few scenarios here, Capricorns. Um, I'm seeing two people that broke up that might want to get back together here. I'm also seeing that someone has left a commitment here because they know that this person might have feelings for them. That's this high priestess here with the moon here. It's almost like there's like secret admirer, admirer or someone here that is waiting to, to have the secret be revealed. It's like they're wondering if this Knight of Cups feels something for them. And I feel like they're waiting on that knowledge before they make a decision here to move on. Tell me more about this page of swords. So again, this could be someone that you broke up with or it could be somebody new. Someone that you have your eye on possibly because this person has their eye on someone with a page of swords. Tell me more about this page of swords, please. 
Ace of Cups reversed. My goodness. I feel like someone here could be returning because they are emotionally unfulfilled where they currently are at. Yeah, I have the Queen of Cups reversed. So this person could be um, dealing with someone in their life that there's no love there. There's there's just manipulation and and unhappiness, and so they want to they want to return to someone. This could also be the person that um, because Ace of Cups could also be a very intense disappointment intense heart heartbreak intense emotions about something that didn't work out so this person could be feeling regret about whatever happened here and could be wanting to return to have a, a discussion to talk to to send a message i feel like they're very in their head about this I have the wheel reversed right after that. So this could have been a situation of bad timing or just karma or bad luck. Um, it could also mean that there's no movement at this time. So what's this tower moment? Tell me about this tower moment for Capricorn, please. For Capricorn, please. Tower moment. King of Pentacles reverse, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. Okay, instability. King of Pentacles reversed. Um, they tend to be greedy or selfish. Um, all they care about is their finances. And they'll do whatever it takes to take advantage of a situation that benefits them. Tell me more about this tower. Five of Wands. So whatever tower moment this is, is going to cause arguments, possibly with this King of Pentacles. Tell me more. There could be disagreements here. Um, conflict, just conflict drama. Tell me more about this tower. This tower, the Hangman. This tower could cause a King of Pentacles to be financially in financial struggles to suffer financial struggles which is this ten of pentacles reversed here they were once stable and secure and they no longer are this is someone who could you know be just struggling financially feeling um feeling a bit insecure here now with the hangman i feel like this tower moment is helping someone see a situation with new eyes a new perspective here. This is also someone who's willing to kind of let go and let a situation unfold. It's almost like they're not going to fight anymore. Very interesting energy. Eight of Wands reversed. Um, I'm getting the sense that this person is stuck there's no movement for this person at this time based on this tower moment whatever's happening it's almost like you know communication is 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 at a standstill they're not able to move forward this is very interesting i feel like both of you are going through your own struggles here but but I feel like together you guys have a past. The, this mutual energy is something that didn't work out, someone that gave up, something that wasn't, it didn't last here. There could have been lies. There could have been um, someone that just gave up on the potential of something because it didn't get off the ground or, you know, the, the communication was not there. Something happened here. And so I feel like there was a divide. And then for some of you, this is someone that you want to go come back to and you both want this. For others of you, this is someone who you want to um, confess how they feel because 
It's almost like you know, like your instinct instinct is telling you that this person's interested, so you're waiting for them to open up, but they're going to be delayed because of this tower moment. However, they want to talk. They want to come back or return or leave this situation. It's like they're almost unable to leave a situation. If this is not someone that wants to return to you, if this is someone new, then they just, they're not able to leave their situation right now. I'll leave it here, Capricorn. Thank you so much for checking out this video. I hope it resonated with you. Um, if it did, please let me know in the comments. I'd love to hear from you. Otherwise, check out your other placements. Sometimes those can resonate more. Not every reading you watch will be for you. So check back next time to see if that reading will be for you. And I think that's it. Thank you so much for watching and take care.